Hey guys, it's me, Carrie, and I apologize for the terrible lighting and camera angle. This is a really random makeshift setup on my bed because we have our Christmas tree on the table downstairs where I normally set up now, and um, I just wanted to get these videos shot, and there's no room down there. So anyway, we're doing it up here. But I'm giving a shout out and also pointing an accusatory finger at my dear friend Jess Phelps because Jess bought some of these mini brands toys and when she did an unboxing in a Facebook Live about a month and a half ago, yeah I think it was actually on Halloween, um, I thought these were the coolest looking things. Hi Sydney, are you going to come up on the bed? My orange cat. Hi, buddy. Do you want to come up on the bed with mama? Hold on, we might have to pick up a cat. Come here, you want to come up? Come here. Come here, big boy. He's very big, and he's 17, so he needs some help to get up. Here's the boy. Say hi, Pippin. Hi, baby boy. Oh, here you go. There you go. But anyway, so Jess bought some of these mini brands toys, and I thought they were so cool. And Brian and I saw them at Target today, and he said, do you want a set to, like, unbox on your channel? I'll get them for you for Christmas, and you can just, like, have them early. So I was like, okay, they look really fun. I need toys like a hole in my head. I need anything like a hole in my head, but whatever. You know, sometimes you just got to splurge and do, do the fun thing. But anyway, it's all new mini brands. These are Series 3. You get... There are over 100 to collect, but you get five surprises inside this little capsule ball. So you peel that first layer, and then there's another layer. And then inside is the white ball. And it is broken up into five segments. So it's like pre-segmented like an orange. And once you peel that off, I've never done these before, so this is brand new. You have all these five little sections. And I guess you just kind of... Oh, there's like a cap in the end here. Yes, Sid, there's a cap on the end. This little cap holds them all together. So I guess if you wanted to keep the ball to store them in, you could. Yes, I know. You're loud. I know. I know. And there's a cap at the bottom as well to hold them together. But then they just kind of pop apart. Yes, they pop apart, Sid. Yes, they do. They pop apart, buddy. He's a good boy. Hi. Sorry. When the cat is right there and waiting to be scratched, you scratch the cat. If you're a cat owner or a cat mom. I don't like to say you own animals because you don't. But pet parents, you want to touch the babies. You're going to come back on so people can see you? No, you're going to sit right there? Okay, let's get back to it then. Okay, so we got five little orange segments here. And there's a little tab that you pull here, I guess. And it peels off this plastic and it reveals your item. And there is a collector's guide, I'm assuming, with each piece that you can check off. Go ahead, buddy. Oh, you're too low. People can't see you. Let me pick you up again. Let me pick you up again. Oh, come here. Come here, bub. Come here, bub G. Sydney has many nicknames, one of which is Bubba G. Oh, his claw stuck on the bed. Come here. Come here. Hold on, Mom. Hold you for a minute. Hold on. Time out for cat hugs. Want to say hi? Say hi, buddy. I love you. I know this isn't interesting probably to anyone but me, but I'm holding my cat because I love him. And he doesn't come up in the bedroom that often anymore. You're a good boy. You're a good boy. I'm waiting for Facebook to remind me when his gotcha date was because we adopted him in December of 2004 when he was just seven months old. So he's 17 now. And his gotcha date must be coming up. I'm going to put you down so we can show everybody the toys, okay? And then we can snug some more. Okay, so this one contains, this one is Icy. So it's just a little cardboard box, actually, that the Icy's would come in. It's really cute. I would have rather gotten something like plastic than just a little cardboard box. I didn't know you actually just got the box and not the item, but it's still really cute. So that's the first one. The second one is, do, 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 do. and this was $6.99, by the way. Oh, a lot of these are in boxes. Yeah, they're just little cardboard boxes. Oh, that's a little disappointing. I hope I get some that are in plastic containers, but this one is a little box of wheat thins. 
um, yeah, it was six ninety nine, and you get five. So a little over a dollar a piece. Okay, hopefully we'll get something that's. Oh, this sounds like pieces. Let's see what this one is. Oh wow, this is a whole big thing to put together. What the hell is this? Hmm. Okay, I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a shopping cart. Okay, it's a little push shopping cart. That's actually really cute. It's got pieces to put together and instructions. I'm going to hit pause and try to put it together real quick, and that way you guys can see it. So hold, please. Okay, guys, so here is the cart put together. It came with two little stickers that say mini brands. I just stuck one on the front, but it's got like this little expandable handle and then like this little handle if you wanted to hold it that way and then it's got little wheels so you can put your little products inside the shopping cart I don't know that more than one will fit the wheat thins will fit so we got the wheat thins the icy and the shopping cart so far and then we've got two more let's see I hope I get a plastic one. Oh, okay I think I did I did this one is this one is Oscar Mayer bacon it looks like oh my god I am so old I need a magnifying glass to read this <laughs> that's really sad um Oscar Mayer naturally hardwood smoked bacon so there is the front of the pack and I'm getting a phone call of course when I'm busy doing things that is the front of the pack and that is the back of the pack and it's plastic with just the paper like sticker on it that's really cute. And there's like a little plastic at the bottom there. I don't know. That's just extra. Okay. And then last but not least, we have got one more. Oh, this one's really cute. Okay. This is more of what I was hoping I would get. These plastic ones that actually look the shape of the product and everything. It's not just a cardboard box. This is Classico Creamy Alfredo sauce. And that is really, really, really cute. It even has the little atlas and mason because it comes in a mason jar on the side. That is stinking adorable. And there's the back with the ingredients and the um, the calories and all that stuff. So that's really cute. So I'm less impressed by these two because they're literally just cardboard boxes with nothing in them. That's a little disappointing. But the other three pieces are actually really adorable. So I'm happy with those for sure. And the shopping cart is really, really cute. So would I buy more of these? Maybe not, but I'm glad I have this one pack. They're really, really cute and fun, and I'm not saving any of this stuff because I'm a hoarder or a collector, whatever you want to say, and that's unnecessary to hang on to, so I'm cleaning my bed as we go along here so it gets done. But yeah, so that is it. So like some of the other items, like I know Jess got like um, a Hershey syrup, that one I really liked. You can get gold ones. You can get glow in the dark you can get metallic and then you can get the commons which are most so the gold looks like there's chocolate hershey's chocolate syrup hershey's strawberry syrup and icy actually in a cup that's really cool um icebreakers gum i have to use my magnifying glass again um holy guacamole guac and i can't tell what that product is some kind of candy i think love hearts those are the gold ones there's glow in the dark there's a metallic and then the commons so yeah the glow in the dark you can get flavor ice royal whatever royal brand is royal brand i can't tell mike and ike mega mix sweethearts uh candies and is that almond roca or almond milk i can't tell the metallics, you can get a strawberry Hershey syrup. We get a wheat thins. I guess that one wouldn't be in cardboard, maybe. McCormick apple pie spice, royal, I think that's pudding. Hershey cookies and cream bar or crystal light drink mix. And then there's all the commons. There's a bunch of candies. There's a, like random sweets. Yeah, there's all kinds of interesting things here. Let's see. And then as far as containers, you can get the shopping cart like I got. There's another big shopping cart and there's plastic bags. And then you can also get um, like display cases like these. 
and I think that one's a little scale. There's the one that I got right there. So there's all kinds of interesting things you can get. But they actually were really fun to try. Oh my God, there's a mini Pez dispenser. Oh, I would love that one. Of course, that one is a oh, collector's case exclusive. Oh, pardon me. I won't be buying a collector's case. I have way too many toys. But this was fun to do for an experiment and check them out and unbox them with you guys. So I hope you found it fun. Thanks for watching. I hope you have an awesome rest of your day and I'll be back soon with more stuff. Bye guys.